Hello, my gorgeous gastronomes and vampires. Welcome to T-Rex Steel City Mukbang. Where will this food journey take you today? Pull up a seat. Let's eat. Guys, <clears throat> I am on this breakfast kick, okay? I'm always on a breakfast kick, but I've just lately been recording most of my breakfast. I have some Bob Evans Link sausage, a fried egg over medium, and I have a recipe that I kind of borrowed from Promo STK, eating good in the neighborhood. This is French toast waffles. French toast waffles. Now, before I tell you any more about it, I just want to thank all my subscribers. Old and new, thank you guys so much. I appreciate you. And to those of you who have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. Now, take a look at this waffle. French toast waffle. I made an attempt at making French toast waffles before, <clears throat> but I didn't do them up like promo STK. So when I saw her video, I decided I was going to hook mine up too. So <clears throat> if you want the recipe to this, just head over to promo STK. Eating good in the neighborhood. And you can get it. Mm -hmm. Guess what? You want it. You definitely want it. <laughs> yeah, go get it. Mmm. Mm. Yeah, I should have been doing mine like this all along. We got another beautiful rainy day here. Overcast. I'm just looking out the window at it because it's just beautiful. I, I love rain. I, I tell you guys all the time. I love my rain. It just makes everything seem so <clears throat> fresh and smell clean, you know. I just love it. I don't mind being out in it. As long as it's not a cold rain. I don't mind walking in rain if it's about, you know, between 40 and 80 degrees. <laughs> Any of those cold, freezing rains? No. Like when you're getting down to 35, 34, no. Right when it's going to return to snow? No. <laughs> mm -mm. I hadn't planned on shooting a video this morning, but <clears throat> hey, I was getting ready to eat, so 
<clears throat> you know, might as well pull the camera out every time you eat. <laughs> that way, you never know what type of good footage you might pick up. All you mukbangers out there, that's just a little industry advice. Try to film every time you eat. Not necessarily do you have to post it. But you never know. This is a big bite right here. Right. I'm about ready to tap out already. But this sure was good. Peace out, my gastronomes and vampires. I will see you soon.